It's like you have a nice little honey glow to you. It's called highlighter. It is! It is! It is. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to the August 2020 unboxing of the Keto Crate. Let's just go ahead and jump right into it. Oh, I see some coupons here. We have a Primal Kitchen coupon. Oh, we have a little Primal Kitchen insert. Thank you, Primal Kitchen, for all of the literature this month. We have the August 2020 Keto Crate literature. We have some awesome stories in there. One from Keto Tracy. Okay, so let's just jump right into it. The first thing that we have is like a little insert. So it's a tea. It's called Sport Tea, the ultimate daily beverage. And it has like... A, a leaflet <laughs> that goes with it. Uh, clearly, they can't get all the information you need to know on the little packet, so they uh, provided an extra insert here. Sport Tea, the ultimate daily beverage with EC ginseng, vitamin C, and electrolytes. Okay, I am definitely here for electrolytes. Naturally citrus sweet, promotes alertness and no negative attributes. Absolutely no negative attributes. So this is like a hot tea. Pour fresh boiling water over one tea bag and let's steep for three to five minutes. Or you can make an iced version of it as well. Hmm. So maybe this is like a Zip Fizz but in tea form. Maybe if you can't handle the sweeteners in Zip Fizz or something and you prefer tea over like a fruity energy drink type thing, this might be the beverage for you. Okay, next we got a beef stick. Ah, uh, just... You know, it's a beef stick. County Archer Jerky Company, pork stick, pineapple, whoa. Okay, now this definitely piques my interest here. Like, what business do they got making a pork stick taste like pineapple? I don't know. Pork raised with no antibiotics or added hormones. We're definitely gonna try this. Like, I'm just interested to see if it tastes anything like pineapple. I doubt it. How many carbs does this have? Two total carbs. Yeah, serving size is one stick, so two total carbs and two net carbs. But hey, if this actually tastes similar to like pineapple and makes it taste good, then those two total carbs are totally worth it. I can't wait to try that. We have Primal Kitchen Collagen Peptides. So that's what I figured there was going to be a Primal Kitchen's product in here with all of the inserts. This is just the unflavored collagen Y'all know I like my collagen to taste like chocolate. So, you know, this is good if you don't have that requirement or if you want to mix it into food or something like that. One packet, zero fat, zero carbs, and we just got protein here. I don't know if we're going to try this on Smash the Crate. Like, it's unflavored. The whole purpose of it is to not taste like anything. So, we may just leave that for a rainy day, but it's always good to have some collagen on the go. Ah, oh, Raw Rev Glow. I really enjoy these Raw Rev Glow Bars. This one is creamy peanut butter and sea salt, and I really know that I'm going to like this. I think I've had this flavor before. Maybe it was salted caramel, but regardless, these bars are just kind of like, they remind me kind of like no-bake peanut butter cookies. Like, they're a little soft and, and mushy, and I am definitely here for that. Serving size is one bar, has... 180 calories, 11 grams of fat. It has 17 total carbs and 14 are fiber. Jeez Louise, three net carbs. And then we have 15 grams of protein. I am excited for this. Next, we have an Atlas protein bar. Now, I've actually never heard of these. I just recently saw Matt and Mega from Keto Connect try these. And I, I literally wrote it down on a piece of paper like, hmm, I've never heard of those. I've got to go check them out. So, of course... The Keto Crate delivers it right to my house. Like, they know what you want, and they give it to you preemptively. Like, I absolutely love the Keto Crate. This flavor is, oh gosh, peanut butter and raspberry. Why would they add raspberry? But if this tastes like a peanut butter and jelly, I retract everything because I love peanut butter and jelly. But, like, oh, yeah, I know how I feel about fruit-flavored stuff, but I'm still going to try it. And it's actually quite weighty. Like, it, it has some some density to it so I'm excited about that one bar is 220 calories 11 grams of protein 22 total carbs 10 fiber and 7 vegetable glycerin which you should be able to subtract as net carbs so what is that 5 net carbs still kind of high but I'm here for it uh, and then 15 grams of protein 
Yeah, the ingredients are whey protein concentrate, peanut butter, tapioca fiber, vegetable glycerin. So yeah, this is like a protein bar, but I'm still here for it. Oh my God, this, what is this, the greatest hits? This is a monk pack keto granola bar. Like I absolutely love the monk pack keto bar that I got in a previous keto crate. I don't know if I've had this flavor. No, I definitely haven't had it. Coconut cocoa chip, this is gonna be so good. One gram of sugar, two grams of net carbs. They already tell you that, I am so excited. One bar is 140 calories, 13 grams of fat, 12 total carbs, four fiber, half glycerin. So I'm imagining there's some allulose in there, which is what they are subtracting, yeah. Uh, and then four grams of protein. I am very, very excited to try this. Next we have, oh my gosh, we have Perfect Keto. I am so excited. Perfect Keto Snickerdoodle Keto Nut Butter. So it is a nut butter that tastes like a allegedly Snickerdoodle. And this is a big sample pouch. Like absolutely, I am very excited about this. Now it says knead and squeeze and I'm kneading and squeezing, but I'm sure I'm gonna have to do more kneading and squeezing uh, before we try it on Smash the Crate, which I just literally <sighs> totally forgot that I am participating in my Carnivogist challenge. And so I'm not gonna be smashing the crate this month because I'm going carnivore. Oh, I just forgot. Well, this is a big pouch, so there's gonna be some left over for me for September, okay? But this is, I mean, huge. Like, yeah, there are six servings per container. Each serving is 180 calories, 17 grams of fat, nine total carbs, four fiber, and three sugar alcohol. So that's two grams of net carbs per serving. I bet this is gonna be great. And then four grams of protein. This is really substantial, like way to go Keto Crate. Okay, you guys, we might just need to delay Smash the Crate until September because there are so many things in here that I've actually been on the lookout for and have specifically wanted to try and I just can't stomach the thought of not being able to try them. it! this is High Low Life Super Cheesy. This is a cheese and nut mix, think Keto Farms, but I was like, oh, I love when there's variety on the market, so I would love to try your crispy cheddar cheese and almond snack mix. Like, wow, I saw this ad on Instagram. Oh. <sighs> One container is 250 calories, 20 grams of fat, five total carbs, two fiber, so that's three net carbs and 13 grams of protein. This looks so delicious. There's just so much stuff in here. We also have a Primal Kitchen Mint Chip Protein Bar. Now, I honestly think I tried one of these Primal Kitchen little bars before and I did not like it, so not sad I'm missing this because of Carnival August, but I'll be happy for my mom and Richard to try it to see what they think. This little bar nugget, geez Louise, 200 calories for this little square, so that's gotta be very calorie dense. 16 grams of fat, four net carbs, and eight grams of protein. Oh, this is interesting. I ain't mad at it. Then we have some Quavos. I absolutely really love Quavos as well. These are like egg white chips. Dill pickle, I've only ever had the sour cream and onion. So this is gonna be exciting to see. Yeah, these are Quavos made from egg whites. They're not really a chip so much. They remind me more of a cracker, like a, like a cheese it texture. So it's not like a crunchy potato chip, but like it does have nice cracker vibes. Serving size is one bag, 140 calories, 10 grams of fat, eight total carbs, four fiber. So that's four net carbs, which is really good for this bag. That's similar to a bag of Quest chips and eight grams of protein. I am definitely here for these Quavos. I am not here for this Sweetwood Smokehouse Fatty, although it is jalapeno flavor, y'all gonna choose August of all months to hit me with a jalapeno fatty, but like, I'm still not sad that I'm not gonna try this. I mean, these fatties are, you can't even tell how thick they really are. I mean, this is almost like a hot dog. Like, I would not want to try this beef stick. There is no nutritional information. You have to get that online, but like, Gosh, these things are crazy. Oh, and then we have some Scuda sea salt pumpkin seeds. These are delicious. I've had these many times before. They are great. 
They have the Franche in them because Scuda is actually a Canadian company. I didn't know that till recently. A serving is one third cup and there are 250 calories, 19 grams of fat, seven net carbs, seven total carbs, five fiber. That's only two net carbs per serving and 14 grams of protein. Yeah, these look delicious. Oh my gosh. And then also, oh my gosh. And then there are Kiss My Keto, Keto cookies. Like what? There is so much stuff in here that I have never ever tried before. And these are the butter flavor, like butter cookies. Are you kidding me right now? If these taste like those blue tin cookies that I get around Christmas time, y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me nothing. We are, we are definitely saving some of these for September, but like OMG, these are sweetened with allulose. So there are two servings per container, 170 calories per serving, 13 grams of fat, 12 total carbs, seven fiber. So that is seven and then four grams of allulose. So three net carbs per serving and then three grams of protein. That is so exciting. Uh, Kiss My Keto has branched out into so many different other products. They used to just have bars for all I remember, but now they got cookies, they have bread, they have noodles. I actually just signed up to be an affiliate with them. So if you wanna try any of those things and get some money off, you can use the link in the description below. Also, if you not only wanna try Kiss My Keto, but all of this stuff in this keto crate, you can get $10 off your very first keto crate by using the link in the description box below as well. Like, this is a great crate to start with. Like, wow, that, that was all, I mean, but still, there is a lot of stuff going on in this month's keto crate. Like, there, like, there are so many things I haven't had and there are brand new products that I've never seen before. Like, this was a great crate, hashtag, great crate but in addition to being able to get ten dollars off your very first keto crate you can win your very own august 2020 keto crate i mean this is a good one by commenting on this video letting me know which of these products you've tried and liked or which ones you would like to try and a winner will be drawn over on our smash the crate video but like i'm super jealous that i'm not going to be able to partake in a lot of this stuff this month but like we saving some stuff over you know what i'm saying Comment down below and you could be entered to win the giveaway. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly full days of eating, monthly weigh-ins, monthly keto crate unboxings, the occasional product review, recipe, date night, random video with my family, and a bunch of other stuff. You can also find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Patreon at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll see you next month. Girl, showcase this keto box, and you better quit playing with the whack fan. Keto crate, thank oh. you very much. There is actually a product called the keto box. You better showcase this keto crate. Okay. I'm out of your hair. Thank you. I love you.